What's up guys, a Rude Awakening here coming to you with my first video and this will be an unboxing of all the recent packages I've received or either bought and there's about four of them, there's one right here, so we see another one right here, another one here and there's a two pack. We're uh, gonna start off with this one. So this one is Basic Top Picks Jeff Hardy. Now. It is not the best looking Jeff Hardy, does not have the best face paint, has no face paint to be honest, but I am trying to collect every single Mattel Jeff Hardy that I've ever made, and I do not have this Jeff Hardy currently, so I did need to get this one, as you can see. Pretty good face scan, you got the purple arms, black suit. Nice, just nice figure all around. It's got the little, little ear gauges that, you know, Randy Orton put his freaking wrench through it, but we won't talk about that. Nice little detail for his sideburns. Just a decent figure to get my collection up. I have, as of right now, um, the Elite 75 Jeff Hardy, and I also have the Ringside Exclusive Brood Hardy Brothers Jeff Hardy. So I will be showing my collection, full collection in a different video. But this is the first one. Um, second one, we will do the two pack that I got at Walmart. I was surprised that this was actually there. It is WrestleMania 22. Well, WrestleMania exclusive, but WrestleMania 22 battle pack, Randy Orton and Rey Mysterio. This is where they had their triple threat match. I wish it was a three pack and Kurt Angle was in this and it had the title. That would have been really nice, but I love this Randy Orton and this Rey Mysterio just looks amazing. So open this one up as well. It also comes with a chair. I'll pull out the chair first. I don't really collect the uh, accessory, the uh, battle accessories, but this will have to work. So actually, to be honest, a really nice looking chair. Like it, the, I don't know if you guys can see it, but this part comes out a little bit and the sticker is like nice on there. WrestleMania 22 is just a nice WrestleMania. Good logo. The chair's got a little bit of cushion on it. It's pretty nice. It sits down pretty well. Nice and flat. Uh, Next, we have Rey Mysterio from when he won this match. And this is just a, I, one of the best Mysterios I've seen. It's not the coolest looking colors, but his tattoo details are all there. His back tattoo is amazing. His arm tattoo is really nice. They even got the tattoos in the inside of his arm right there, as you can see. They got this tattoo, it's really nice. And his, his colors are just so basic and nice looking. Like His mask is just black and white and then a little bit of gold on the back. And then you got gold over here with the 619, it's nice. The white outside says Ray right here on his thing. The white goes around. You got more gold over here, his little design. It looks really nice, really nice Ray Mysterio. And then also, this Randy Orton, same thing with Randy Orton. His tattoos are amazing for a basic, very nice tattoos. They go all around his arm and the inside of his arm as well. His shoulder, his back tattoos. Very basic uh, gear. Wish he came with a shirt or something, but it's just, I, I like this Randy Orton from when he had his hair like this. And this was like from Randy Orton when I was a kid, like the legend killer. So I needed this one and I love that Ray Mysterio. That Ray Mysterio was awesome. So that's that battle pack done. Uh, we will save the big box for last. We're gonna go open up this one. As I said before, this is a loose figure. I got it off of somebody on eBay, but it was just one of the best looking figures and I knew I couldn't leave it behind. So I had to, had to get that one opening it up now. Sorry for that noise in the background. Nice bubble wrap, thank you very much to the seller for that. And uh, here we go. I'll show you guys a figure. It is Papa Shango Elite. What a figure this is. Like, this figure is just, Amazing. His tattoos, again, phenomenal detail. Great ring, great attire. His head is so nice. His face paint on his head is so nice. His, the back design. And he also comes with these accessories that I gotta put on him right now. My pops are falling off my desk because I don't really have much room. He has this hat that he comes with. Let's put it on his head. Actually, let's not put the hat on because he has this necklace that's like a little... I don't even know how to explain it. It's like a, it's like bones. Like, you know, Papa Shango, he's a crazy character. 
And he also has this stick that I'm guessing was like when you had to do with the Ultimate Warrior, when he was like uh, putting the Ultimate Warrior under spells and blood was coming down his face. Hopefully you guys remember that. That was a crazy time. And look at him with all his accessories on. He looks so nice. What a nice figure this is. Great figure to add to the collection. This just comes out, looks the fire, pops out. Just such a nice figure. All the details are so nice. Let's set him up right here. Let's set up the other figure as well. Randy, Ray, oh, Ray fell. Jeff, and Ray. Get the little box. Now, we got the big box, and oh, I cannot wait for this one. I've been waiting for this figure for a long time. This is one of my favorites ever made by Jax, actually. It's not made by Mattel. This is probably my favorite Jax figure ever, I think, ever came out with. Oh, pack of peanuts going everywhere. Let me cut this right here. Hopefully these packing peanuts don't go everywhere. Uh, here he is. Let's take it out. Let me settle this box down. It is Classic Superstars Series. I, oh, I can't remember when it was. I think it was Series 12, NWL Hulk Hogan. What a figure this is. Nice NWL heavyweight belt. Has a scarf right here, the glasses. It's just a nice figure. Nice pictures of Hogan on the side. Hollywood Hulk Hogan right here. Him holding the belt. And then we got other figures in this line. It's Hulk Hogan, Bruiser Brody, Chief J Strongbow. That's a really nice figure. I want that one. Classic Freddy Blazy, Vader, Jerry the King Lawler. That's a really nice one. And then also Cowboy Bob Orton Jr. And as, like my collection, my whole collection, I didn't get to mention this, is all open. So I'm going to be open this one. As much as I shouldn't, and it's a collectible, I'm going to have to open it because that's my collection. So, going to open this one up, show you guys this figure in detail, and all the accessories it comes with, which is really nice accessory, accessories. I think this is the best NWO Hogan they've made to date. Unless Mattel finally gets to making... A NWO Hogan, which is, I really hope they do, and wow, this scarf is amazing. It, it's like one of the craziest accessories I've ever seen. It's got like little hooks here. Oh, look at that. Look how big it is. Wow. This thing's huge. Nice black and white scarf for him. Don't look if you don't like this. The box is destroyed. So we got Hogan's glasses right here. I'm going to try to take out these glasses and don't break them. Hogan's glasses. I'm going to set these down right here. Oh, drop them. Let me show you guys. Nice black glasses. Oh man, this belt, man, this belt is amazing. Such detail on this heavyweight belt. It's so nice. Oh, I'm trying to focus, come on. It's so nice, it says NWO on it. It's perfect. I wish it had Hogan's nameplate right here, but it. I love how it says NWO on it. That was perfect addition. And then his actual belt that goes around him, the Hollywood belt, I'm gonna, Try to, oh, it doesn't even, oh, look at this detail. It has, it looks like right here, it could actually undo like a real belt. And I thought I was gonna do like a real belt, but it would just, it connects right here underneath. I don't know if I can show you guys, but there's like a little, let me get it in, I'll show you guys. There's like a little, like Mattel belts, like those little two buckles there, it's kind of like that. And there's buckles right here, it connects like that, perfect. Now for the figure. Man, is this a good figure. Wow. See his uh, nice and bald like all the Hogan's are. Uh, his, his cap that he wears, his bandana goes around his head, so it's Hollywood. What a figure this is. Nice NWO shirt, perfect gloves. His pants are just so well designed. I'm going to cover his boots because those are really nice, but I'm going to show you guys after. His pants are so nicely designed with a lightning bolt coming down. It looks amazing. Same thing with the other side, riding bolt. And look at his boots. So nice. Hollywood right there, a picture of him. And on in the inside, it says NWO. Such nice boots. Those boots are amazing. I'm gonna try to put all the accessories on him now. We're gonna put his glasses on. 
the glasses are hard to stay on because unlike Mattel figures, where they have the uh, they have the hole for the glasses, like to put on the head, like in the, on the side of the hair, this one doesn't come with it. So this is gonna be hard to keep the glasses on this figure, to be honest, which sucks. Let me put the scarf on him. Oh, I dropped something. Got this bandana back. I'm gonna have to keep the glasses off for now because they're super hard to get on and I don't want to bore you guys with me just trying to get the glasses on. Then of course, I'm gonna undo the belt so he can wear it like he was playing guitar like he normally did. Like I showed you guys in the box. The belt was undone. His belt is a little small, but that's how Jax made their belts for a little bit. It's like, not the, not the best belt, but you have to make do. I love the Mattel belts. Mattel makes the best belts, for sure. Just great belts by Mattel. So he's gonna hold it like this. Put this on right here. Hold on. There we go. I'm trying to get it. Look, look how nice it looks right now. Can't really see his face, but boom, that's so nice. Put this in his hand. And then the other part of the title goes across like this. And we're gonna put his hat on and his glasses. Oh, this is such a pain in the ass to get the glasses on. Man, does this fucking suck. All right, I'm gonna have to do the glasses after. But, glasses off. This is what he looks like. Crazy scarf, he's got his nice belt in his hands. Like he normally would. Oh, nice belt. I have to use the belt after. He's got the scarf, the hat. Man, this figure is just amazing because I love the scarf. I love the shirt. And like I said, the details right here, beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. So to recap, we have Series 12, I believe, Classic Superstars Hulk Hogan. We have Basic Top Picks, Jeff Hardy. Elite Papa Shango, fantastic figure, fantastic figure. And we have the battle pack of Randy Orton and Rey Mysterio that comes with the chair. So thank you guys for watching this week. I will be back with another unboxing next week and hopefully more videos to come during the week about uh, maybe some of my favorite figures and my collection and also going to Target, Walmart and figure hunting. Stay safe and peace.